Hello everyone, CNCHD here and this video is all about the aircraft carrier, so uh, this aircraft one here. Um, it bothers me to see in some videos how the people use the aircraft carrier, they really misuse it and don't use it at its full potential. So in this video I want to show you how to use it correctly with the most um, efficient outcome. Of course there will be one person who says oh, it's more efficient this way and <laughs> it will totally be more efficient this way so if you are that person please show me so I can also improve my carrier play. First off if you play a mission map or the campaign and someone gives you this aircraft carrier first off use the shortcut the click on the aircraft carrier click on CTRL hold it and press 1 or two, or three, or five, five, six. I don't know. Needs to be secured, but the I use one. Ah, uh, please be quiet. Thank you. There we go. So you have it on a short a shortcut because most map creators won't give you this button on the bottom right. This one here, beneath the artillery here. So if the ca um, creator doesn't give you the shortcut here on the bottom right, have it on a shortcut with that. Also it's more easy selectable so use the shortcut. Most people just use the carrier and just click on the target like that. The raptors fly in in flocks with two raptors each time. That will have the effect that we will lose raptors. You lose them and you don't do much damage. It's really inefficient. You see how many raptors are lost. It's it's insane. Now here I got a promoted one that is also very important to keep a track of. You really want the promoted raptors in your team. Please don't kill me. Promoted raptors do more damage. They heal themselves and yeah, you you want them. Uh, not heal, but repair, I mean. Broken English here again. Okay, so we now have one promoted raptor, that is nice. Uh, the carrier has rebuilt all of our missing raptors. If you lose too many raptors, this will take forever. Until you have reached the normal amount of raptors again. So you don't want to do this. You took some heavy casualties here. I think I lost like four raptors. Could have been a promoted one. So what you want to do is use the guard button. You guard here the area. And now what that will do is you collect the raptors in one space. Preferable in a space where the raptors don't attack something which passes by like a random supply plane or something. You want them to be collected in a place where the raptors don't attack. Otherwise they will uh, shoot their ammunition on a target and that will minimize the uh, filled in fuel or um, ammunition I mean. Okay, now the, ra the carrier is empty. We have all the raptors at our disposal. We can use them to make co coordinated attacks. For that purpose it would be wonderful if you have something to Serving scout, air for air example a Chinook. So if I use that Chinook, Keep it safe. that re reels me Plains a bit off motion. the map. So for example Plains I see the bunker, I see the stinger sights here. The stinger sights are the main target, also the quad cannons. So I now press the button 1 because that's my shortcut and I will now attack the bunker because it's behind the stinger sight. And when they shoot on the bunker, they will also damage the stinger side. So I do that, and then I need to attack the stinger side. They attack now. They will be there oh, shortly. never mind, they didn't. <laughs> jet. We have a new but now, with that, we I think we just lost one raptor. Yeah, we lost one raptor. Two raptors, actually. Okay, we lost two raptors. Because I didn't shoot on the stinger side. Should have shoot on the stinger side. I thought they would destroy the stinger side if they destroyed the bunker. Well, uh, my mistake. But we didn't lose so many raptors. If you compare that with our previous tech. Now these raptors, they uh, will repair themselves once they landed on the ramp. 
you will have to wait for that because you don't really want these raptors to attack anymore while they are so damaged. So give them a bit so they can repair. We also still uh, have this promoted raptor. We added a second promoted raptor to the mix. That will help us immensely. <clears throat> okay, the raptors are repaired. We can now do that again. We got the area here. This raptor will still repair while he waits for the other raptors to fly off. It takes a bit of time. You need to have some patience there while you do that. But this is really the most efficient autocom with the aircraft carrier. Uh, for me at least, because I only know of this tactic. Okay, let's use our Chinox. Get some more vision here. We have this stinger side, this stinger side, the tunnel, stinger side, tunnel. So we have three stinger sides here. I will reveal them with my Chinook. Like that. Raptors all here. Let's attack. I mean, I could also use the bombardment, but this video is just plainly there to show the uh, Raptors. So let's attack. Now you need fast hands. We attack. And we attack that. And we attack that. Okay, uh, we lost two raptors, but we dealt good amount of damage here to the stinger sides. That removed that one stinger side, we again only... Oh, stop, no, you, know, you, you don't want to attack. Use the stop button to cancel the attack. We now have three promoted raptors. Like this you get a lot of promoted raptors. You want to have as many promoted raptors as possible. I think I lost the map. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I was never defeated before on this map. Uh, but yeah, you got the idea. Um, get them in flocks. Like, uh, like used guarding mode. Guard mode, um, have them there, guard the area, and then attack the stinger sites with these grouped up uh, raptors. Once you have the feeling that raptors have shot enough missiles on the stinger site while they are attacking, click on another target so they can attack two stinger sites at once and destroy these two stinger sites. This way you will lose not many raptors because they are in a group, they take less damage. And you will get your promoted raptors much faster. Once they are promoted, they do more damage, they heal themselves, uh, you can attack faster with them. So that would be my advice on how to play with the aircraft carrier, should you play on a mission where you are given an aircraft carrier, in the aircraft carrier. Hope this helped you out in some occasions. If you don't see this aircraft carrier and that often hint hint to the mission map makers add in more aircraft carriers please and yeah we see us in the next video till then goodbye